What's good guys? Welcome back to Ron's Rise News. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video where today we get the debut of the Cadillac GTP Hypercar. Now the Cadillac Project GTP Hypercar debuts to preview the brand's latest endurance racing machine that begins competition at the Rolex 24 of Daytona in January of 2023. And it will also be a part of the grid of next year's 24 Hours of Le Mans. And track testing will begin this summer. Now, by competing in both the 2023 IMSA and WEC championships, Cadillac Racing has the opportunity to demonstrate its capability, craftsmanship, and technology. Now, the Project GTP Hypercar features design cues from Cadillac's road growing vehicles. Now, this is most noticeable at the front end, where the race car has vertically oriented headlights that cascade down the nose, and the sharply chiseled body panels also evoke modern products of the brand. Now the racer's shape has sharp protrusions coming out of the front and rear fenders, and these pieces don't attach to the main body, though you can't call them flying buttresses. A tall fin bisects the rear deck and attaches to the tall wing. And Cadillac's announcement says that we are seeing previews of the look of the GTP hypercar that's going into racing. Now the aerodynamic testing is complete in the lab, but the car still has to undergo actual track testing. It's possible that things might change depending on what drivers and engineers experience when on a real circuit. Now Dallahara will supply the chassis for the Project GTP hypercar, and power will come from the 5.5 liter dual overhead cam V8 with the LMDH category's common hybrid system. Now, there are no other mechanical details available at this time, but Cadillac will have lots of competition in the LMDH class. For example, Lamborghini is teasing its entry that has sharp styling that evokes the brand's road-going supercars. Acura is also offering a glimpse of a car with huge headlights, and BMW recently unveiled the exterior of its car in this class that the German brand calls the M-Hybrid V8 LMDH. And beyond the eight-cylinder layout, there is no mechanical info about that racer either. Now, Porsche appears to have its entry deep into development because the company has already evaluated the vehicle on the track. The power plant is reportedly a twin-turbo V8 and the class-mandated hybrid tech. But with that said, what do you guys think about this GTP hypercar from Cadillac? And would you like to see a road going version sometime in the near future? Let me know down in the comments below. Now, if you guys did enjoy the video today, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Giving the video a like will help get it up in the rankings. More people can see it and we'll have a bigger discussion on a new Cadillac GTP hypercar. Now, with that said, if you guys want to help further support the channel, always check the links down below. I have a one-time link donation for my PayPal, my Cash App, my Venmo, and my Patreon, just in case you guys want to donate an extra dollar or two to the channel. I appreciate that extra love and support, guys. Thank you so much. You guys can also check out the Ron's Rise merch in case you want long sleeve shirts, t-shirts, hoodies, stickers, everything Ron's Rise is there. And I'm also on TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter. See everything I'm posting, car memes, pictures, and videos that doesn't always make it here to the channel. Now make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, but click the notification bell so you don't miss one video. And with that said, you guys be blessed. Have a great day, and we will talk to you guys in the next Bronze Rise News video. Peace.